Alright. Let's get it poppin'. I mean, it's Hell March. It's Hell March, so it's poppin'. Uh, fledgling imps. Oh, another shard tail run. She, it's son. With, like, the most powerful combo, by the way. Exiled melting. Oh, this will be beautiful. And we get a fledgling imp, too. This is great. This is great. So, I want either Rally or Imperialist. We'll go Rally. I, I don't think Imp Raid is the ideal in this one because past the first play on these they're essentially coming back for free I think royalty is the way here ooh lost the luggage beautiful I mean these are all good uh, hmm cheaters hand maybe but I got Steel and Hellhorn right together. I don't know. Maybe I just do... I could do Gurg's Goad? I could. Light's Gift, even. I mean, if I want to set up top... I think I'm going to do Gurg's Goad. I mean, an early Gurg's Goad. How can you not do that? Spikes... Ah, it could be annoying. It could actually be annoying. I could set up bottom if I want to try to bring her back. I don't love that. I don't know. How, how much can I kill these before they get to me? That's the question. He'll have trample too. Um, that's a little bit annoying. I mean, this could be tough. I might, I might want to skip this trial. So this isn't... This is not in the bag by any means. Let's do this, this, this. What we're going to want to do is hurt the boss as much as we can until it gets up here. And then put a, we'll want a steward in front and ideally some sort of a reformed chumpy thing so that the trample doesn't get through to us. And hopefully we've got a few uh, triggers of rally by that point. I do want a fledgling in the mix. Let's do this. I'm gonna do this, that way I kill that. Um, I'm actually fine doing this. I want the fledgling to come back, because then I get the extra scaling. I think we just bring these back, so we'll do this, this, I think I do this, that way I can get that damage in. I don't know if I play this or not, I think I do. But I want this to die because I want, I'm trying to greed here for the double uh, fledgling imp. Alright, this is fine. We'll do this. This isn't the greatest, though. Um, man, do I take five here or what? I have no way to kill my own units. The thing that sucks here is I really want the extra space for other stuff, so how greedy can I be here is the question. I gotta imagine I'm getting enough... Primitive molds. I'll have three health here. It's not great. Well, we'll just have to work with that, I think. Uh, I don't want to put the stewards into the reform pool, though. All right, let's do this. We'll get our stats up. I mean, if anything, I'll get 76 damage in. Uh, you know, 
it is what it is. I th think I do. Do I do that? I don't know. I kind of want to keep the higher HP units in the pool. I think I'll sacrifice 10 damage for that. We'll just see what the best unit we can get back is. Fledgling. So we'll do this. And then, oh, he was actually already dead. I I guess, what was that? Oh, because I had, I had just enough health. I didn't even factor that in. I thought two hits would kill me, but yeah. Turns out 13 is more than 12. So we actually were fine even without doing that. So it worked out. We lost 10 health. We could have maybe went behind Shardtail to mitigate some of that, but knowing what happened, I think we could have, but eh, it's fine. Welder Helper, though. Mm. You gotta do that. Oh, Molten Encasement. So that's also amazing. There's so much we have here now. This is insane. Uh, we'll still go this route. We want the Gurg's good value, but the Infusion's gonna be some form of Imp. Um, we'll see. If I can get Endless, I'll still take Endless, you know, I would take it. Um, and, yeah, we'll see. Well, I can't play the Demon Fiend, so that's an issue. So I think we'll just take Steelworker for now. Um, okay, probably not taking any of that. 30 magic power, nah. I could keep it for now. I mean, I do have the Welder Helper. Question is, what do we want to do here? So... I kind of like putting this onto this right now. You know, that there is Tomb Synergy, there is Imp Synergy. Well, we have more options of Imp Synergy, so I think I like putting the Tomb into this. This will most likely die, right? And then I just bring it back. Nice thing about this too is I don't need Endless that much because I can reform them. Um, I think I will do this play. Fledgling Imp is oh, it's doing its full value anyway. It's not one of those that gains extra value by the infusion, such as Queen's Impling, Welder Helper, or Molting Imp. I think we keep it at 40 shards for now. That's a lot of shards. Uh, do I want to, like, add any... I could, I guess, reroll for some health on the Steelworker. I wouldn't be opposed to that. Damn. Well, sometimes you just can't find health. I mean, technically, Wickstone is health. I don't think I would do that. So we kind of wasted 60 gold there. I could do this just to help me right now. I think I'll, it, it, this might just be fine. Definitely regret the, uh, I, I think the, the reroll was worth it. I would have took Battlestone or 25 health gladly. Especially when you got, like, this coming in. It is a unit draft. Uh, I don't know if it's smart to do this. I think we're just gonna skip here. We got 40 threat level. These are no joke. These fucking hasters are just bullshit. So, let's put you down first. I think I'll frontline with this. I think we can do this. Do we do this? I mean, that's already a pretty good amount of damage on this floor, and then it gives me some buffer room, because they will kill this guy eventually. Um, I'm... Eh, maybe I should just put this one up there. If I do this, though, it gets into the reform pool. I think I want that. I probably should have just put that guy up here. I could have got extra damage and stuff. I think we can do this. Hold these for some reason, sure. So this guy should die. Oh crap, he's not dying because he's getting armor. <laughs> well, this wasn't the greatest. Um, if he's not going to die, we might as well just do this. Save. A little bit of damage. Man, I hope I didn't fuck myself by doing this. I mean, it's a lot of damage. It's It might not be enough. I mean, I got a lot of armor. I don't know. Hopefully this is fine. But yeah, it was. this was not the, not the greatest turn of events. 
Looks like we do it anyway, so nice. Steelworker for you. <laughs> so misplays aside, we still get through without taking damage. There comes a certain point where it's like, I could add another fledgling imp, I could. Um, do I need to? Like, maybe just a vent here would be better. You know, that fledgling imp won't be better than this fledgling imp. I think we do a vent or a horn break. Horn break would allow me to kill my own units, which is good. Like, if I, if I don't roll into Imperialists, this might be needed. I think it gives me a nice out there. Giraffe. I'm not opposed to giraffe. Then again, it's... I, I don't know. It's really good. I just don't know if I can really commit to that. I really have to commit to reform being the plan at that point. I mean, reform is kind of part of the plan. But, like, I don't know. Um, I'm already multi-striking with the Steelworker. Slash whatever I end up infusing it into, maybe. I think Dripfall could be better here. I'm also taking too many cards. I need to cool off on that. Uh, I don't have any money here, but I think I'd rather have a Hellhorned unit. Uh, if such an option comes up. And I'd like to just maybe get some more Merchant of Steel upgrades. Gotta imagine this would be great. Let's take that. I mean, if we know how good that is. Damn, endless. Okay, let's see if we can get some gold somehow. Well, we don't, but I'll take that. Definitely take that. That's busted. Alright, what were the upgrades? Sad to see that go, but hey, we got 25 health. Hmm, there's the Horned Warrior. I would take it, I think. I could... Now, he's already triple striking, so this is already basically the unit we had last game, which we know is good. So, I could eventually infuse the current Steelworker onto it. And maybe the floor is just Shard Tail. And I bring back that fledgling imp that gives us stealth. That could probably be enough, honestly, alone to win us the game. As long as we keep our pyre health up. I mean, it, if I can get some supplemental AoE, maybe I'm pretty sad I didn't take that vent, but I do have the horn break that can take one of the squishies out. And then maybe I just let a squishy through. Uh, I still take the three big tanks out. Just talking about divinity, really, but... I'm planning ahead. Maybe I need to focus on the now. 55 shards is not nothing. Double exploder is not nothing. Let's see. So I got the Hell's Banners. Let's do this. I'll get one pip here. Unless I want to go down here. I just I don't know that I want to with all that rage coming in. I don't need the hugest floor to make a pretty good floor here. So like... Shard Tail. This... Uh, this I could just do this to get it out of here and keep my space open I think I'm down with that let's just do that then as far as this goes I think I just get rid of it I don't really care about burnout extension what I care is to redraw into the right stuff I suppose I could just do this too. I, mean, I may actually do it there. I just don't know if I'll have enough damage because then I stop the rallies here. don't want the f steward in the pool. Nice. Alright, you're dead here. That's fine. I can I can live with that being in the reform pool. Do I want this into the reform pool? We already have this and this. 
This isn't going to prevent him from dying. I think we just let him die. Here we go, right here, right here. So let's see what we get here. Okay, we... I mean, we can do this, I guess. Because um, here's the thing. Uh, this thing is going to blow anyway, so I'm at least soaking that up. I think it's bullcrap that this kills stealth units, but it is what it is. Let's get some damage in here and not do anything else. I'm definitely getting a lot of stats on Shardtail. Um, take that out, I think. I'll take a damage here. So be it. I'm not too worried about one little damage. I'm going to keep that out of the pool. Nice. We definitely want that. Stack that crap up. And we'll do this. Just let him do some damage. I think I still keep the other stuff out of the pool. There's the wing maker. Alright, we'll do that. And how else do I want to do this? Just do this. And the other guy burns out anyway. And you're dead, but let's see what we got back. You? I thought I, I, thought I cleared out the crap of that. Okay, whatever. We got the worst thing here, but that's fine. We're still killing him. Had an extra Queen's Impling I forgot about, I guess, in the reform pool. Oh my gosh. When you're lucky, you're lucky. When you're lucky, you're lucky. I mean, do I do Pip or Draw at this point? Uh, I think I have this hammer, so just p draw, right? That hammer will be my pip. Well, there's no Merchant of Steel. Um, I could Hellvent the Transcendent, because here's the thing. Endless is less needed, since I can reform this crap, you know? I kind of want to... Get, since I have a hell vent here, I'm gonna do my my impling infusion. Although for this one, do I want to do fledgling imp? Nah, I think we just do this. So impling into transcend imp. We'll hell vent it. We're going into Shardsville here. That's for certain. I mean, at 30 here, we're definitely going into Shardsville. I'll see you there. I'll see you in Shardsville. Um, but Hellvent definitely here. Even if it's not endless, I am fine with it. Get rid of all the other units. I can get rid of just everything here. We're ready to face Divinity. Yeah, I don't know that we want Imp Parade. That really convolutes the pool. If we have to go full rally, we have to go full rally. Obviously, I'd rather have Imperialist. It makes things a lot easier. But, you know, whatever. I think the 7 seal should be fine. I mean, I've got fuckloads of damage. There is the 180 health guys, though. I often lose runs because I do stupid shit like this. Um, yeah, whatever. Let's do... This. Do I need this or would I... I, I think I might want this because I want the damage. I do need to still make that infusion. Uh, do I... Uh, maybe I shouldn't have even done that. Here, let's do this. Let's do that. That. This. Boom, baby. I regret getting that one in, but, you know, whatever it is, what it is. Let's get an extra slot up here, I think. I want that extra slot there. And I need to keep this going, I think. Even if I'm not killing it here. Damn, I'm so close to killing it. Shit. Let's get rid of that. Alright, this will kill it. Alright, I'm keeping you out of the pool. 15 by 2. 
Uh, I'll lose an ember by doing this, but I want to make sure I don't die up here. I'll let that die, though. Yeah, nothing else is getting played. Alright, so you die. I could take that damage if I need to. Don't really need to, though, do I? What if I just did this or this? Let's do this. I'm fine with that thing dying. I'll take this. Well, I'll have Hell's Banners here anyway, so. Ooh, nice. So let's do this. Boom. Machine gun activated. Get rid of that. My reform pool is looking sexy. Get rid of that. Let's bring you down. That way you're there for this turn. I mean, we might as well do that. Ha ha ha. Let's do this and this. That's a lot of damage. Do I do this? Sure. All we need to do is get one reform here, and that should do it. Well, not that one. Fuck. Okay, whatever. Pretty sure, though, we got enough here to kill him. Oh, shit. Okay, we need a good one. We need a good one. What the hell? Come on. You got all this other shit you could give me. You could give me this twice in a row. You, you one out of four me. That's one out of four. Twice in a row. Oh, well, this should be enough. Just doing that and then that on top of it. You can try and RNG me. RNG, you might try to fuck me. But I ain't gonna let you all the time. I guess that's better than 25 gold. I doubt I'll be able to utilize it. Uh, I guess a tiresome climb could be good. You know, it could I might need that Daze on Divinity. An, a targeted reform seems good to me. There's also AoE. I mean... Seraph the Temperant? I don't know. I've got AoE with freaking Transcendent, right? Sorry, some side stuff going on here. Okay. Hef? No. Hef, you can't come. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not a huge fan of Hef. I would be down to put Endless on one of these imps. I certainly would. Let's do it. Eh, Vortex might have been better though. Like Holdover would be pretty nice. A multi-strike. Well then. One more. I mean, Quick might be better. Nah, whatever. And... Burnout initially on one of these is fine. If that's the case, that one should go and oh, yes. Okay, you're the endless one then. That way, if I never find Imperialist, it's still just always dying and I can put it wherever. And I guess I'll infuse Worker into Horned Warrior. I mean, I might as well. Also makes it easier to draw into Transcendent. 30 power... 
I mean, we are going way into Shardsville here. I don't think I need that, honestly. Should I just purge something out of here? Like, these could probably go. The other uh, battering ram could go, but battering ram still does kill stuff in this deck. Do I need a multi-strike here? I don't think so. I don't want to risk dying. Just for an artifact. Like, it's all kind of win more at this point. Uh, let's see. So... Let's do this. 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 And then if that dies, that's fine. This way these can like do some damage and then just not die. Alright. Um, maybe I should do this to start getting, like, armor for the, uh, the bad guy. What's his name? The boss. Okay, that didn't kill it. If that's the case, let's bring you back so that I'm getting extra armor each time now. I'm getting just extra armor, so that's like a good thing, yeah. We want to build up armor for the stealth boss, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Hell, let's just do it all with imps. I can build a hell of an imp floor. that. We will do this with imps. Let's get this out of here. Do I bring this guy down? Probably. And just do that. Probably should have done Wicked Blaze, but whatever. Look at that. Don't even need my units. Just use imps. Just beat a 145 sharded stealth boss with imps alone and cleared all the ways before they even got to me. Oh man, important work. Uh, Impish Scholar though. Don't want that back. Yeah, there's no good consumables, so I'd just take the important work. Uh, resin removal would always be good, I think. You never know. There's always things I forget about that it could be good on. And I have to imagine hell venting the endless transcendent clearly has to be the call here. Where are ya? This one. Yeah. I mean, trans you know, again, we learned things until we got transcendent, and then we learned that transcendent probably needs a nerf. <laughs> Because once you find Transcendent, everything goes out the window and you just win the game with it. Uh, we can do this. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still possible to lose with it. We'll do our due diligence. Did that in the wrong order? Whatever. We should be fine. Let's see, let's do this. I'll 
leave that one out. We'll kill these units just with the units up there. Definitely doing that. Definitely doing... I mean, I guess we should start doing this, right? And then... This... This... Or you can go... Here, the one that's not burning out should probably go in front, right? Get all the armor. And then eventually we'll get horn break and get more armor and stuff, and yeah, profit. So I'll keep getting the armor in rage. Do a little bit of damage there. Does this need to come down? I don't think so. We just need to kill our welder helper, hopefully before too long. What's in the pool? That? Eh, we don't want that. Actually, what we do probably want to do is to reform it so that it's out of the pool. Yeah, that works for me. I do believe a flying kill is in our future. We could probably just do it right now, huh? Yeah. Alright, Fell. You've been killed by imps. At least the unit's got some action there. Hallowed halls? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. But last stand, though... Last stand, though. I can see that working. Uh, more draw. Yeah, let's just draw it up. No hell vents here, but we got removals, which is nice. I think I'm down with that. The removals probably just go on these implings. They're not really adding much value at this point. Hold over there, there, right here. That has to be it. Tell me I can spell chain it. Okay. I mean, I I understand. That would just be a little too OP. Do I do this into anything? I mean, I could do that. I could. I could put this into the fledgling imp. Then instead of 20 to the front, I just get 10 to everybody. I think I'm fine with that. That that gives me even more insanity. It also just ma it thins the deck out a bit. Um, I, mean, I could keep purging stuff. I, I really don't need this battering ram, but... I don't know, maybe I do. I should probably just purge that, right? Everything else is pretty good. Remove. Let's see, Hellvent over here. I could remove one more of these. It's fine. I just want to make sure I don't low roll. I don't have the intrinsic Awoken Spike this time around. Okay, no Imperialist, that's fine. That is fine. Spell shield. Mm, you know what? Could get screwed on it with the old Wii Maker. Wish I put the piercing on it now. I should have just put the piercing on it. I don't know why I didn't do that. So only Wing Weaker get, does get screwed, but that's not nothing. I mean, these guys are no joke. I can't play my units if I'm Ember Drained. Then again, does the Wing Maker even kill that much? I mean, most of these floors are like tanks, right? Um, let me double check that. I forget exactly what the pyre wing floors are, because I, I rarely get this troop. It's like always fucking penitent. Where is pyre wings? So they have one light wing on the second wave, 
two light wings in wave four, and then that's it. The rest is all tanks. So does it really even screw me that much by taking this trial? I don't think so. I think I want that gold. I'm greedy. I'm greedy. All right. Oh, well, let's do this. Lost luggage actually helps us get to the stuff too. Not the greatest uh, set of openers here, but you know, hopefully we'll, we'll get to something here. At least my units die, which is nice. We may set up mid here. All right, let's do this. I need to get that fledgling imp going. here. Get a rally for whatever that's worth. Sure. Alright, now we got these guys. So let's do... I can fit all four of these here. I might as well. Let's put you in the front. And then you... That way I get more transcendent value. I may actually do this. Well, nah, I'll do horn break for that one. Okay, we can do this, I guess. I can do that. Let's see, 46. I was gonna tire some climate, but nah, whatever. Hmm. We wanna kill this. But maybe we can pivot to down here now. So that. <clears throat> maybe we can do it. We can just build a floor with these two, huh? That'll be good enough. Let's kill that. We can get that down here. <clears throat> Alright. Welder helper. Now we're getting even more armor to the whole floor. I love it. should actually keep this out of the pool, I guess, maybe. Oh, I should have last stand, actually, is what I should have done. Damn it. Missed opportunity there. How about you don't attack me? Boom! Knee shot. <laughs> Something down there. Shot him somewhere down there. Ooh, imp in a box. Impish scholar, I think we've determined, is a no go in this deck. But hey, imp in a box. The possibilities are endless. Don't think we really need a crushing demise. I think we can just skip these. Anything that's not a transcendent is kind of just out of the question right now. Most things are not a transcendent. Eh, maybe. I could see this being good. I could see this being good. I mean, I get a lot of damage from it, technically. Uh, this is probably better, though. Because I do get the slays off those things. Oh, man. And the burnout. Well, now we got three in the book. That's not bad. Um, now we got four in the book. This is also not bad. Can I get double sums on every... Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Two, four... Um, five gold short shit. Well, let's just do this one, then. And do I remove something? Sure, let's remove... Uh, I could just remove Horned Warrior, honestly. Let's just remove the Queen's Imp. 
All right. This should be fun. All right, we're going to start with you. Then this will create two. Oh, and we get it back. I mean, this is a floor right here. We should do this. Get some more. Oh, yes. Okay. And then we'll do this. And then we'll do... I guess this. <laughs> Fuck. Um... I don't want to play the other one, but I'll, I'll do this. And then uh, this. And this. I still have enough room, right? Four, yeah. Uh, do I do these? Let's see. I guess I could do it. I don't necessarily want them to come back though, so why don't I bring one of them up? And then if these die, they die. That's fine. How are these guys not dying? What am I missing here? Only you die? Are these guys quick or something? Oh, right, because you give stealth to everybody. Well, there you go. Him dying is fine. Uh, let's see. What is in the pool? Oh, yeah, we'll do that. Guess we'll do this. Do that. We don't have the armor yet. That's the only kind of shitty thing here. Man, I don't have enough space for all this shit. Maybe I, I need to get that hammer. Uh, I could do this. Okay, there's the welder helper. Shit. Oh, whatever. Let's remove that. Uh, maybe I should have removed the damage shield. Oops. Or whatever. You guys are stealth. Okay, we got this. Now we got some space. Now we got some space. Okay, you're gonna get that. Let's do this to get this back. Maybe I get a welder helper. I do. Let's do that, and then he still dies, which is great. Or I could just luck out here and get him back right now. Why don't we do that? Okay, never mind. Actually, this is still fine. Because now I can do this. Get more rage. If this comes back, I'm fine with that. I mean, it will come back. I have Imp in a Box and Last Stand coming back. I mean, that's, that's pretty good, I think. There goes the floor. Oh, apparently the floor is not dead. Uh, I think I actually want less stand back. We'll do that. I'm on the limit here. So maybe, yeah, let's get you out. I think we're getting a flying kill, ladies and gentlemen. I think we are. Yeah. Do that for good measure. Jesus. Boom. Imp build. Well, you don't need anything for this. I could I could have no champ, no banner unit. This is all imps. This is got to be the best combo in the game, actually. I think uh, Viable was right when he gave his initial estimation of uh, which ones are good. Let's just start doing this. Let's get it popping. There we go. We don't even give him anything. Uh, these guys are gonna die. Should I just not play them then? 
Actually, if I do this, they won't for... I, I might be able to... Yeah, we can just do this. That's fine. What is this shit? You're killing me? That's not fair. Boom. Boom. I mean, we got a floor here. We're, we don't even have rage or anything like that going right now. We can do that one here. Get some more of this. Oh, that's right, I have this. Well, they're not dying anytime soon. Alright, let's get some shit going here. Alright, you... Actually, you should go in the... F like, you need to die. I want, I want you to, like, be replayed. It's okay, overcharge tank. Normally, I'd be scared of this floor. Trust me, not scared. Not scared of anything. This, uh, you know what, actually? Here, we should be getting this. Yeah, let's do this. And eventually I'll get a permanent uh, fixture in there. Like this. This, for example. <laughs> Let's see, four. I still need that space, but we can do this. Should have actually done that up here. Oops, whatever. This guy's going to have a lot of damage. Bye bye, mini boss. And uh, in a turn from now, they should be dead. Yeah, I could do it up here, but I want to kill like all the units, so let's do that. Bye bye. Step one: probably nerf the queen's impling infusion. Step two: probably make it so transcendent can't trigger its own infusion summon. Uh, you know, exponentially. That's my recommendation. Because Transcendent will still be insanely good. But right now it's just stupid. <laughs> Gee, I wonder who the MVP goes to. Queen Zimpling, clearly. Anyway, thanks for watching. Until next time, peace.